Suri Namaskara B, Sun Salutation B. Start in front of your fabric and then reach your arms up, grab your fabric and pull it to your shellacs or where your bottom of your shoulder blades are. Bring your arms through the fabric like you're wearing a backpack and then take a seat into Ukatasana, chair pose. Step your feet forward, feet are gonna be hip distance apart and then your arms are gonna come straight up, drop those hips. Take a nice breath here, and then as you exhale, lean back, straighten those legs and arch back, sort of like a mountain flying pose. Open your arms in a T, bend your knees, and lean yourself forward, coming up onto your tippy toes for skier. Then bend your knees and take another seat into your chair pose. Then step your left leg back and your right knee will be bent. You'll come into a lunge and arch back into crescent moon. Hold your fabric and externally rotate that back leg. Your front knee still stays bent, arm come out to the side for warrior two. Take your arm through the fabric and straight overhead for side angle pose. From there, bring your arm back through the fabric and glide the front arm to the back for peaceful warrior. Your knees are still in that lunge position. Cartwheel your arms down to the ground, step your front foot back to meet your back foot, and then come to Chaturanga by bending the elbows, untucking your toes, and inhaling to upward facing dog. Exhale, tuck your toes, and step back into downward facing dog. Adjust yourself however you feel comfortable. Spread your fingers out like starfish, and then take a nice inhale and exhale. When you're ready, step your feet under your plumb line. Inhale halfway up, Adha Uttanasana. Exhale, full forward, Uttanasana. And then inhale, swanda of the arms up to the sky for Tadasana Mountain Pose. Then bring your fabric back to your shoulder blades and take another seat into Uttanasana Chair Pose. Just repeat on the opposite side. As the fabric catches you under the shoulder blades, lean back, arch back, and then take a nice breath, bend your knees, lean your hips and chest forward, and come into this plank position. Use your core here as you lean forward in the fabric, bend your knees, come back to chair pose. Then step your right leg back into that lunge position, arch back for crescent moon. Take a breath here, hold on to your fabric, turn your externally rotate that back heel 15 degrees inwards, and come to warrior two, arms are out to the side, then bring your front arm to that knee by bending the elbow and reaching your back arm up over ears for side angle pose. From here, bring your arms back to a peaceful warrior. That front arm goes straight back over your ear and your back arm comes down to your thigh. Then cartwheel both hands through your fabric, step your front foot back into a plank position, and then you can do chaturanga by bending the elbows, untucking the toes, inhaling the chest up and through. Then exhale yourself back into downward dog by pressing back. Maybe you need to shorten your stance by stepping your feet in and at hip distance apart. When you're ready, step yourself under your plumb line, inhale halfway up, exhale full forward, and then inhale, swan dive those arms up to the sky. Exhaling, bringing the hands down to heart center. Namaste. Remember, you can take any modifications like placing your knees down throughout the sequence. Always remember to breathe. Namaste.